Hello, everybody. Travis Chandler, Chandler Gaming, back here with the next episode of Mass Effect 2 with the Soldier Series. Before we get in the video, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on those notifications so you can be notified of all my videos. <coughs> Let's just get down to it with this video. Okay. So now, more than likely, Thane's going to want to talk to us. So we can do his loyalty mission. And then we'll do Samara and Thane's loyalty missions. So we can... Um... Get a little bit of cash... And then we'll go back to Ilium and finish everything up in Ilium. Fane would like to speak with you, Commander. E yeah, I thought so. Okay, getting some lag here for some freaking reason. Is there something wrong? Yes. Now that you are here, though, it seems more difficult to talk about. Are you feeling sick? I could get the doctor. No, no. Though I suppose that is a part of it. My mortality has me dwelling on things. I had a family once. I still have a son. His name is Kolyat. I haven't seen him for a very long time. You never mentioned this before. Why now? When my wife departed from her body, I attended to that issue. I left Kolyat in the care of his aunts and uncles. I have not seen him or talked to him since. Well, that's not the choice I expected. Why didn't you raise him yourself? My body is blessed with the skills to take life. The Hanar honed them in me. I have few others. I didn't want that life for Cole yet. I hoped he would find his own way. If he hated me, so be it. He would not have shared the path of sin. I used my contacts to trace Cole yet. He has become... disconnected. He does what his body wills. Well, what's wrong with him? Is he hurt? Something happened that should not have. He knows where I've been, what I've done. I don't know his reasons, but he has gone to the Citadel. He's taken a job as a hitman. I would like your help to stop him. He is... This is not a path he should walk. I'll get us to the Citadel as soon as possible. Thank you, Shepard. I'll be meditating until you need me. Okay. So now we need to go to the Citadel again. Which, that's fine, because, uh, well, first, no, let's go to Omega first, so we can drop off that data package, and then we'll go to the, and we'll do Samara's mission, and then we'll go to the Citadel, get the other data ma data package, and then we'll, um, see if we can use those Forge IDs, and... No messages for you, Commander. Okay. But first, we need to explore out here. And I do want to check 
Well, no, because we just left there, so... I want to check those investments, but I, I don't know how they really work, so we might just check them while we're here. There we go. Okay. Okay. So we'll survey the. It should be depleted, but no, it's not. I'm surprised. But it is now. <laughs> No, I got a friend of mine that I'm really happy for. She, she, um, gonna have a baby, and I'm I'm really happy for. Her. Aww, that was a failure. Okay, the smear campaign. We got that success. Um, the politician retires from public service after the smear campaign. We we got credits for it too. All right, success. The police quietly slipped me a cut from the raid on the Red Sam factory. Nice. It's only three thousand credits, but I'll take it. Um, clashes between countries of the Vitarian homeworld and. Whatever are becoming frequent. Make sure no nation state gains more control than the others by regulating weapon sales to all sides. Hell yeah, we'll do that. In chemical warfare, binary helix is trying to develop hormone implants for for alliance soldiers that fall outside the Citadel's genetic treaty laws. The company is prepared to be very generous if you let them know when the Citadel inspectors are coming. Okay. <laughs> Pick up the delivery while we're at it. Not like we really need the resource, but we'll take it anyway. I never understood how this worked. Okay, so you leave and come back and your stuff works. Or I think you leave and come back. I'm not sure about that but we'll have to see we're gonna try do some trial and error here that's what we'll do some trial and error but no my my friend's having a baby and I, I'm really happy for her and she had a scan and the baby looks healthy so that's always good to know, you know? I mean, yeah, not my baby, but, you know, I still, I'm happy for her, though, so. Okay. Nope, okay. So we probably have to go to another planet to get it to... Okay. Okay. So, like I said, I just wanted to test to see. that That's all.
Okay. We'll save the crashing ship first. Why not? Why not? Okay, first we're going to go over to the other systems. Whoa, there's one over here I didn't know about. Okay. No, you know, it, it, it'd be nice if I had a family of my own, you know? I mean, I, I'm single, and, you know... I'm 35, and I, I kind of get concerned that it's going to be too late by the time I get established and all that, so... You know, may, maybe I'm... I'm supposed to be single, you know? See, I kind of like, when I was a kid, I had a grandfather who had his own horse ranch, you know, had a horse business, and he worked for himself, and I always thought that was cool, and I always wanted to do that myself, was work for myself. Okay, that's it for this one. Like I said, it's not that I really need the resources, but I do it anyway, because why not, you know? Especially since I have the one probe resource. Um mod installed, you know, which makes this game 10 times more enjoyable. <laughs> I mean, fuck using like seven, eight fucking probes on a single planet, you know? Here's an anomaly. Oh, it's a gap. It's a gap. Okay. So that means we bring Tally out.
You. You. There you go. Gonna have the heavy pistol now. Do we just kill the Gath? I think we do. Yeah, I can't get these guys in this fog. Well then get out of the way, Tally. Shit. That should be all of them. It is. All right. Cool. This is valuable. What we get? Damage protection. Nice. We'll take the damage protection. Hell yeah, we will.
That way, them were tougher to kill. There we go. On to the next system. Which is the um, main one, okay. Okay, then the broken arrow. We don't want that viper piece of shit. There we go. Okay. Okay, so we need to... Okay, there it is. Okay. There we go. Nope, we don't go that way. Nope, we don't go that way either. Okay, we can't keep fucking around with these guys.
I mean, I don't know where to go. I, I don't... I don't know where to go. It's not this way, is it? There we go. Nope. Not. So, I don't know where to go. Because they say go this way. Well, the problem is, you can't go this way. Oh, it's down here. Okay. Out of the way. The okay, there we go. Okay. So we saved the colony. Got some creds for doing it, but... Which we wanted, so... We'll take this one. Because we haven't explored this one yet. We took care of the platinum rich planet, so I don't know why that didn't go away. I have detected an anomaly. Here's an anomaly. I'm just picking somebody random, you know?
Well then, get out of the way! You know? Get! Nothing? Alright. All right, so these we just shoot these um, husks, I think. Okay. So they found some sort of alien artifact down here. That's what we're looking for. Okay, we're running out of ammo. We're going to have to go down there and find it, whatever it is. That's what I think is going on here, so... Because we just can't kill all these guys because they just keep coming. Got it. There we go. Okay, run, 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 run.
There, that's what we were looking for. Destroy these fuckers. Okay. Yeah, you just gotta destroy it. Otherwise, they keep coming. That's right. I forgot about that. Okay. Okay, now we're going to go check on those investment opportunities to see if they done anything. Like I said, I don't really know how it works. I don't know if it goes on the game timer or if it um you do missions and come back and they um they get done. I I don't know how it all works. I've never actually done them. Okay, success. The Citadel, Citadel journalists are now reporting live from the tournament systems. Nice. Okay, failure. The nations have required WNDs to tip the balance in their favor. That sucks. And that was a success for Binary Helix. Our agent warned Binary Helix about a Citadel inspection a week before it happens. Nice. False prophets. A rapidly growing cult called the followers of the exalted light of the word is gaining a foothold in Omega. Send agents to infiltrate the controversial religion and siphon off donations, donation money for yourself. Hell yeah, we're going to do that. That's funny. <laughs> we're stealing from a cult. We're stealing from a cult. That's funny. That's funny. Okay, so that colony we saved from that crashing ship. Thanks for stopping it. Stopping that from happening. Pretty much what he was saying. Okay, now we're going to do Samara's mission. So we can turn in that data package. Back to Omega we go. It doesn't matter who you bring out on this one because you won't be fighting anybody. I totally forgot about that. We need Samara in a, now. I'm, <laughs> Duh! This is Samara's mission. Why am I? Oh, I'm stupid. Yeah. 
There, that's better. At least I figured it out before going all the way into Omega. Oh, we need to come over here. Hello again, my friends. Please tell me you have something for me. I have the package from the drop point on Ilya. Excellent. And here's your reward. Simple as that. If you should happen to swing by the Citadel anytime soon, there should be another package there near Marib's shop. Okay. Now we need to talk to Arya to figure out where the Arctic Yachi is. quite so empty as an Ardot Yakshi does. You haven't taken steps to kill her. Why would I? She hasn't tried to seduce me. Her last victim was a young girl. Pretty thing. Lived in the tenements near here. That's where I start looking. Thanks for the help. Good luck finding her. Better luck catching her. Okay, so now we need to go back to the apartments. Yeah, here it is. And then you just come in here. Yep. Are you here about my daughter? My nephew died a week ago and no one seems to care. The medic said it was a brain hemorrhage, but that's not true. It was murder. Someone killed my nephew, my baby. I think she was murdered too. And I'm looking for her killer. Oh, thank you. It's so hard when no one believes you. I'm all alone now. Are you one of Arya's people? I'm here to help. Does it matter who sent me? No one else on this hellhole station gives a damn that my nephew is dead. If you can do something about it, I'll help you however I can. Do you mind if I examine Neff's room? I didn't want to disturb anything. Her art, her sculptures, everything is the way she left it. The way it will always be. <laughs> My baby is gone. <laughs> Thank you. I'm sorry, I just miss her so much. It's okay. We've all suffered loss. I know what it means to lose a daughter. I will avenge her. Thank you. Please, if it helps you find her killer, look through her things we will be respectful I'll examine her things okay so you go in here and really the only thing you want to examine is the diary read the oldest entry hey diary cycle 34 orbit 671 there's a lot to talk about I dropped your roots name and they let me into the VIP room at afterlife I'm sure everyone was staring at me most beautiful Asari starts dancing near me. She moves like water, form and volume, but shifting, changing. I'm in a trance. Then I'm dancing with her. 
middle entry. Cycle 36, orbit 671. <sighs> Am I a freak? Morinth is a girl like me, and she's definitely not human. Just when we dance and the Halix is flowing through me, the way she looks at me with a hunger, a longing, no one's ever looked at me like that. We kiss tonight. Read the newest entry. Cycle 42, orbit 67. She's going to take me to her apartment tonight. Whatever happens, I want to be with her forever. She can sell my pieces. We can live somewhere glamorous, like the women in Vanya that Vid Morinth likes. How did this happen to me? I'm just dumb trash from Omega. Close the hollow journal. This is Morinth's work. She's attracted to artists and creators. Someone with a spark slightly isolated from their peers. She impresses with sophistication and sex appeal. Then she strikes. The hunt interests her as much as the conquest. Anyone who's successfully hunted sapient beings for 400 years warrants caution. Morin speaks to you on many levels. Her body tells yours that she'll bring unimaginable ecstasy. Her scent evokes emotions long hidden. Her eyes promise you things you were always scared to ask of another. Her voice whispers to you after she is done speaking. She sounds more like a highly evolved killer than a genetic defective. The condition has been present since my people huddled around fires at night. Perhaps it is symbiotic rather than a defect. Storming her den would be a mistake. She will have a hundred escape routes planned. She will go to ground and disappear for 50 years or more. This is the closest I've ever been. So we have to lure her out. Exactly. Shepard, you read my mind. Afterlife's VIP section seems her preferred hunting ground. You must go there alone and unarmed. She'll come after me. You can draw Morinth out. She'll certainly flee if she catches sight of me, but she won't be able to resist you. You are an artist on the battlefield. You have the vital spark that attracts her. Your power will draw her in. Time's wasting. Let's get over there. I agree. We can talk more once we're there. Okay. So now we go to the VIP. Now it's been a while since I've been there, so kind of forgive me for looking at the map a lot. Yeah, here it is. Okay. What do you want? Someone told me the rest of Afterlife is nothing compared to this place. Sounds like a smart person. Who was it? Jeroot. Go on in. Word to the wise. Start a fight, we'll hurt you. If someone attacks you, it's okay to defend yourself. I know how to do this. Thank you. I do not share this burden easily, <sighs> and you are the only soul I can imagine sharing it with. God. Why is my nose so itchy? Hey, do you know where to get tickets for Expel 10? I heard this amazing Asari say they were her favorite fan. I want to... I just want whatever she wants. I gotta find tickets. Expel 10 is flying tomorrow. I don't have any tickets. If you score some, I got some creds for you. Don't be like that. I got 
got crabs. We'll go back to my place. I got simple tastes. Back off, asshole. I'm a dancer, not a hooker. You got a mouth on you. I'll enjoy watching you use it. The lady asked you to step away. What the hell? I'm just looking for a good time. This isn't your business. Times are over. Thanks for that. Security was asleep. Are you sure this is where you want to be? Uh, hi. I need help right now, and I don't know who to ask. You're human, and you don't look high, so you're it. Can you help me out? What kind of help? My friend Moiral is doing a piece on Omega Games. She's hanging with Floret. He's the worst of the worst. Your friend could get hurt. Yeah, and she's going to. See, Floret's on to her. His gang is on the way here, and they're going to make a mess of her. I have to get a message to her, and fast. What do you want me to do? She and I have a code. If you go over and say two words to Floret, my friend will get the message and get out of there. The two words are terminal and eternity. In that order, please tell me you can do that. She's going to die. I can do that. Thank you. Thank you. Remember, terminal and eternity. In that order, just work them into a sentence. Terminal and eternity. Okay. I love this place. I love everyone here. I love you. Do you need something, man? Is there a public extranet terminal around here? In a club? You don't have an Omni tool? That is a pretty strange question. I get by on public terminals. My Omni tool's been broken for an eternity. That's a tough break. I'm done talking to you now. Hey, Florit. I have to pee. Yeah? Hurry back, Moirol. I'm ready to head out. Okay. So we got her out. person in this place I've got a booth over here in the shadows why don't you come sit with me okay some nights I come here and there's no one interesting to talk to some nights there's just one person tonight it's you why is that I know what I like do you what do you think of the music here dark rhythms violent pulses it stirs something primitive in me what about you i'm curious about a band called expel 10. they get in my head and tear it to pieces they're in concerts soon maybe we should go together you can lose yourself in the music here there are ways to enhance that you know what do you think of Howard? it slithers through my soul seems like we share some interests do you know anything about art? It speaks to the darkest places in me. What about you? There are certain pieces that grab me. What really moves you? If I saw an image of you, that would move me. Oh, that's, um, sweet of you to say. Art comes in many varieties. I've seen vids that were more powerful than a sculpture sitting in a gallery. Do you know Vanya? My favorite. The two actresses on it are so glamorous. I'll have to watch it. Maybe we could do that together. I've traveled all over the galaxy. It changes you, doesn't it? Real travel means going to dangerous places. Where you can see and do things most people can't imagine. 
Yes. When I travel, I find myself drawn to dark, dangerous places. Violent places? Violence is the surest expression of power. Violence is a means to an end. Power is that end. Do you want to get out of here? My apartment is nearby and I want you alone. All right. Shepard got picked up. <laughs> of a great hunt out for your blood but here it's muted and you're safe is that what you want Shepard people feel safest right before they die it's true we're never safe I've never understood the fascination with safety some of us choose differently independence over submission I think we share that you and I we've both killed many times but that's where the similarities end why do you say that I've killed what do you know? Let's stop playing games. Look into my eyes and tell me you want me. Tell me you'd kill for me. Anything I want. Don't count on it. But you... Who are you? Oh no. I see what's going on. Bitch herself found a little helper. Marin. Mother, do not call me that. I can't choose to stop being your daughter. Mother, you made your choice long ago. What choice? My only crime was being born with the gifts you gave me. Enough, Marin. I am the genetic destiny of the Asari. They are not ready to reveal this. So I must die. You are a disease to be purged. Nothing more. I'm as strong as she is. Let me join you. I am already sworn to help you, Shepard. Let us finish this. End of the line, Morin. And they call me a monster. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I am ready to leave this place and get on with my life. Are you ready to go as well? Do you want to talk about what happened? Shepard, what do you think I will say? What can I say? I just killed the bravest and smartest of my daughters. There are no words. I will try another time. For now, show mercy on a broken old warrior and let us leave. Let's go. Okay. Why did we level up? We shouldn't have leveled up. But we got Samara's power unlocked and a new outfit for her. Okay, so we can get out of here. Okay, so we're getting out of here. We'll go to the, um, we'll go to Liara again, see if those investments have panned out yet, and see how much money we make from them.
But first, we need to talk to Samara. Commander, you received a new message at your private terminal. See what she has to say. survive your mission I am a just a car injustice still exists and perhaps even other Ardat Yakshi you don't want to settle down I did I returned to my home world and tried to start a family I will fight and struggle all my life that is my fate when I die it will not be in bed I am at peace with that you still control the direction of your life I have chosen this path. I truly am at peace, due in no small part to you. Okay. So now, like I said, we're going back to Liara's ship and we'll see how those investments panned out. Or if they even panned out. Yeah, I've got, I'm building up money is what I'm doing so I can finish up Ilium too. Get all the stuff in Ilium and then deal with Conrad, you know. Success, I pocket a slice of credits, raise it the weeks, um, extra net fundraising telethon. Nice! This one says it's ready, but it's not letting me deal with it. That's okay. We'll go to the Citadel, we'll help Thane, and then we'll, um, deal with everything there. Okay. The first thing we're doing, we're going to Merit's shop so we can get that data package.
But we need Thane for this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not going there yet. Okay. We want to go over here. Here's the data pad we was looking for. Okay. Now we want to go to the top floor. I thought it was up here. Guess it's not. Because I know you're supposed to give those fake IDs to somebody here on the Citadel. Okay, then maybe they're down here. No. Greetings, Earth Clan. You will find many excellent ships for sale here. Nope. Okay. Well, maybe we don't turn them in. Maybe it's because we're not renegade enough. I don't know. Because I know we picked them up. Associate is trying to find his son. We think a local criminal may have hired him. That should be easy. We don't see many drill here. There we go. One of my men reported a drill recently. And he was talking to Mouse. Interesting. Mouse? Ah, uh, petty criminal. Probably not the guy who hired your boy, but a messenger. He's a former duct rat. Runs errands for anyone who'll pay. What was it you called, Mounts? A duct rat. It's a local slang for the poor kids who grow up in the station. When they're small, they tend to play in the ventilation ducts where adults can't get to them. Aren't the ducts dangerous? Every couple of months, we pull a little body out of them. Lacerated by fan blades, broken by a deadfall, suffocated by vacuum exposure. Those are just the ones we know about. More just disappear. Maybe they get sucked into space. Maybe they fall into the protein vats the keepers run. The mouse survived long enough that he can't fit in the ducts anymore. He was one of the smarter ones, or the luckier ones. What sort of trouble has Mouse been getting himself into? Odd jobs for shifty people. Duct rats take whatever is available to get by. Data running, fencing stolen goods, selling illegal VI personalities. Actually, he was selling one of you. Me? Yeah, when you erased a file, it would say I delete data like you on the way to real errors. Buggy, though, it crashed every half hour. The error message was about how the galaxy was at stake and you should fix the problem yourself. I've heard enough. 
Mouse is usually upstairs outside the Dark Star. He works out of a public comm terminal. You should pick up a copy of the Shepherd VI when you talk to him. It sounds like your boy's running with the wrong crowd. Yes, I agree. If Mouse can't get you in touch with your son directly, he'll know who can. I'll help you if you need it. We better hurry then. Okay. You didn't tell him that Kolyat plans to assassinate someone. He's a cop. He tried to stop Kolyat and one of them could end up dead. I don't want that. Yes, of course. Thank you, Shepard. Two cases by the end of the day. You mouse? What are you? Oh shit! Krios! I thought you were tired. Commander Shepard? I, I thought you died. What do you want with me? Be still, mouse. You can change your pants in a moment. We need you to answer some questions. And the people I work for. Look, I can't answer questions for just anybody. But you can for me. You gave another drill instructions for an assassination. Who's the target? I, I don't know. I, I didn't ask. Because the people I work with... We don't have time for this. Oh, oh God. Bane, help me. Help me, Mouse. My son is out there. In the dark. That's why I carry for him. I thought you'd want me to. Please. Explain. He came in, said he was looking for work. He had a hollow of me, the, the one you took, Rios. I put the word out. Use your old contacts. Elias wanted to hire him. Elias Kellum. thing that shepherd vi you're selling oh shit you heard look you were dead it was totally legal to make a vi of you give me a copy we'll call it even what i mean sure yeah absolutely sorry about the whole just so you know there's three volts who are patching it all the time i didn't want to do that mouse we just don't have much time just go away man mouse i'm sorry too just go. That couldn't have been easy. Mouse knew more about my life than Kolyat ever did. He smiles up at me, broken teeth and scabby knees. Bare feet black. A dead end future looking up at me, worshipping the petty gifts I offer. I was the only good thing he had back then. But I left him, as I left Kolyat. Don't blame yourself. If I don't, who will? We must carry the weight of our decisions, Shepard. Right. Now we got the information, now we need to talk to Bailey again. Associate son. You talked to Mouse? Did you get the name of the guy he's working with? Elias Kellum. Kellum? Oh, shit. Uh, look, this is awkward. Kellum and I have a, an agreement. He doesn't cause too much trouble and buys tickets to the CSEC charity ball from me. In return, I ignore him. He pays you off. You were eager to help us before. What about now? Is it too inconvenient? Inconvenient. <laughs> I said I'd help. It's just there'll be repercussions if I don't handle it right. He and I give each other space. It keeps the peace. I'll get some of my people to bring him in and set him up in a private room. You can interrogate him yourself. 
I'll stay out of sight. And if I'm lucky, Kellum will believe that I had nothing to do with it. Bring him in. We might not have much time. I'll make it happen. Wait here. We've got Kellum. Tell Bailey we're ready. He'll expect me to get him out of this. Not today, I think. Captain, his lawyer's here. Ben Elias has his VI sent to page him if CSEC gets within 10 meters. I'll stall him. Get in there and work fast. We should question him together. Keep the pressure on. Thoughts on how we approach it? You talk to him. Appeal to his self-interest. I'll put the screws to him if he needs it. Very well. I'll pretend to be on his side. But if we waste too much time negotiating, Bailey won't be able to stall Kellum's advocate. Get me out of these restraints, Bailey. Pretty funny bringing me down here like this. Who the hell are you two? hit on someone. You're gonna tell me who. The only person I'm talking to is my advocate. Here's how it works. I ask a question, you answer the question. You speak when you're spoken to. Who the fuck you think Mr. you are? Kellum, I don't believe you were paying attention. Nice. You just handed me your job. Hit me again and I'll take your money too. I'm gonna straighten you out as soon as Bailey gets here. Just tell us what we need to know. My associate isn't very patient. What are you, frog boy? This little sidekick? What, kid? You gonna bore me into confessing? You ain't shit. Works for me. No! Do you know what I'll do to you when I get out of here? Keep it up, tough guy. You'll leave in a bag. Go to hell. He's up. He's no use to us dead. Are we done here? Because I got people to see. I'm done being patient. Give me a name or I'll cut your balls off and sell them to a Krogan. Joram! Joram Talid, turning in the 800 blocks. He's unconscious. No need to wake him up, I think. He'll wake up with a headache. No permanent damage. We have Kolyat's target. Let's get to Talid before he does. Agreed. What's the story? Why'd Kellum hire the boy? Assassination. A Turian named Joram Talid. You know him? Joram? Yeah. You might have seen his posters around. He's promising to end organized crime on the ward. Thing is, his message is all mixed up in race politics. He's anti-human. If a majority votes for him, like it or not, that's how the system works. That's a nice ideal, Shepard. Sergeant, get a patrol car. These two need to get to the 800 blocks. Yes, sir. Okay. So this can get kind of tough. I'm on him, Thane. He's talking to some voters. Understood. You're in position? Yes. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. I'm following. 
you don't want to get too far ahead of him because it's easy to lose him even though he's got that Krogan looks like he's talking to another voter Have you sent a call yet? no I'm moving to another position ahead of him it's been wonderful talking with you all I hope you'll come out on election day There he is, okay? Because I've lost him before and failed this mission. Do you have the target? Target in sight. Okay. No sign of trouble. I see him. There he is. Okay. This is where I get kind of confused. Stay close, Shepard. No problem so far. What's he doing? I don't have a good angle. What's he doing? One of his guards is talking to the bartender. Looks like a shakedown. I'm relocating to the next room. Let me know if anything changes. Okay. Okay. Hey, who are you? I don't have time for this. And there we go. Down, son. Get out of my way. I'm walking out. He's coming with me. They'll have snipers outside. I don't need. What the hell? Delete. Get the hell out of here. Yeah, yeah, I will. Take the boy into custody. You son of a bitch. 
Your father doesn't have much time left, Kolya. He's trying to make up for his mistakes. What? So you came to get my forgiveness? So you could die in peace or something? I came to grant you peace. You're angry because I wasn't there when your mother died. You weren't there when she was alive. Why should you be there when she died? Your mother. They killed her to get to me. It was my fault. What? After her body was given to the deep, I went to find them. The trigger men, the ringleaders. I hurt them, eventually killed them. When I went back to see you, you were older. I should have stayed with you. I guess it's too bad for me you waited so long, huh? Kolyat, I've taken many bad things out of the world. You are the only good thing I ever added to it. This isn't a conversation you should have in front of strangers. Boys, take Kolyat and his father back to the precinct. Give them a room and as much time as they need. You're doing him a favor, Bailey. Thanks. Yeah, well, send me a Christmas card or something. I have to get back to the precinct. Come on, I'll give you a lift. Okay. So we got Thane's loyalty mission done. I mean, it's simple, but it's easy to lose where that, um, where the target is, the lead is, so I've lost him before, so... through a lot. I ran some searches in the CSAC archive about 10 years back a bunch of real bad people were killed like someone was cleaning house. The prime suspect was a drill. We never caught him. 10 years is a long time. Whoever was responsible for that probably doesn't exist anymore. Yeah I guess you're right about yeah, that. Yeah that's probably true. shot some people no one I feel sympathy for but there it is I watched those guys shaking down businesses and threatening humans but he can't just get away with it the kid wants to make a difference give him community service community service for attempted murder what jury would agree to that none that I've seen this would need to stay out of the judiciary strictly within CSEC interesting I'll think about it thank you captain Okay, and that's all we need to do here in the Citadel. So we're gonna go back to, um... You'd think Citadel security would be the tightest in the galaxy. I see no fewer than 14 fatal flaws a skilled assassin could exploit. Eight of them existed when I was here 10 years ago. Now we're gonna go back to Omega and turn in that data pad. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now that we got everyone um, loyal up to this point, before you get the Reaper IFF, you want to make sure you get everything you want to get done now, because once you get it, once you get that, you must um, finish the game. Otherwise, you'll lose loyalty to those that are loyal. Um, that's why I always build the team. I always get them loyal. If you want to survive the um, suicide mi mission, you have to have everyone loyal.
Okay. We're getting Thane out just so I can max out his Rider ammo. There we go. Hello again, my friends. Please tell me you have something for me. I found the package your contact left on the Citadel. Very nicely done, my friend. And as I promised, your reward. I really appreciate what you've done, friend. I'll toss in something extra for your trouble. Great doing business with you, Shepard. Okay. There we go. Now we got money. Now we want to check Liara's ship again to see how those um, investments panned out. And then we'll go to um, Ilium to see about buying everything. And then finishing everything there. Because I want all the money I can get. That way then I can buy everything. Because <laughs> if you get all the upgrades, it makes the suicide mission ten times easier. You know? Oh, no, no. I don't know why they're not letting me pick that one up. Whatever. Whatever. Okay, so we can go ahead and get out of here and go back to Ilium. There it is. Like, where's Ilium? There it is. Then we'll get Samara out just so we can um, max out her Reeve. do area for you okie dokie now we need to go all the way to the other side of Ilium believe 
what happened. I've got the data. Don't ask, just call and leave. Hey, guy. And we got everything. Nice. Can I help you with something? I talked to an old friend, Conrad Werner. You told him that the Eternity Lounge was selling red sand. Oh, you're Conrad's friend. Yes, that place is really dangerous. I should know. I'm an undercover cop. Did you get me the deed to the bar? I need the deed to, uh, stop the red sand dealers. I softened up the bar owner, but you need to go in and finish them off. Really? Are you sure? Absolutely. You just need to close the deal. Go in, be tough, and let them know you're with me. They'll hand the deed right over. Wow, great. Here, I'll set you up for a discount. God damn it! I didn't know that's what happened. I thought she shut the shot down. God damn it. That's okay. to the judge my surveillance vids caught your extortion attempt from four different angles i was misled i was told that you had agreed to sell take her away before i have my bartender throw her out what happened the undercover cop from the weapons kiosk just got arrested she wasn't a cop she was a deep cover operative from a terrorist cell I'd never have found her if not for you. Really? Really. You did a great job, Conrad. Now please go home. Let me take it from here. Can do, Shepard. And thanks. It's really good to have you back. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so we got everything from Eternity. But I'm going to have to call it for this video because I haven't had breakfast yet, so... Once we get back to the ship, I'll do the um, upgrades, and then I'll call it for this video. Why is Conrad Werner so funny? I, I don't I don't know why. But he is so funny. Okay. Commander, you received a new message at your private terminal. Oh, we don't get any upgrades. Huh. I'll be damned. Okay. Well, we'll go to the cabin, get the auto save, and then we'll call it for this video.
All right, so I hope you all had fun this episode. I did, and I'll see you all next episode.